A head basketball coach at Concordia is out uh, after several of his players ended up in the hospital. It's a story you saw first on two, one we've been investigating for weeks. CBS 2's Sarah Maki is live at Concordia University in River Forest with reaction from the players' parents tonight. Sarah. Mixed feelings. That's how one dad says he feels after hearing about the coach's dismissal. Another saying he was initially disappointed, but now he's upset. So here's how this all happened. Parents and players, they found out in an email from the school Monday night explaining that men's basketball head coach Steve Kohler is out because, quote, significant new information has recently come to light. Now, as we first told you, there were concerns six players ended up in the hospital earlier this month because of a retaliatory practice when the team missed curfew at an away game. We asked what new information the school might have, but they told us it's confidential. They can't give any other explanation about personnel matters. Parents we talked to did have mixed feelings about the coaching change, but they did agree on one thing. They feel that they need more transparency from the school. I'm starting to get a little more upset now, to be honest with you. I mean, you know, bad situations gotten worse, so it's a mess. I don't think the school's been as transparent as as they need to be, and I think I think some of their parents feel the same way from the texts that I've seen and uh, and phone calls from them. Four of the school's trainers quit after Kohler was initially reinstated. In just the last hour, we heard from the school that they are able to continue with their other sports, though, because they now have temporary help with licensed and certified trainers. An assistant coach, Rasad Searles, he has now been promoted to permanent head coach. Jack Concordia, Sarah Maki, CBS 2 News. All right. Thank you, Sarah, for staying on top of all of this.